What's going on YouTube? It's Tez. We back with another video. I know it's been a minute. We got the 335 right there. It's been a long process, man. Um, going through everything with this whole incident, with the accident, dealing with the insurance. I'm not even just going to speak on that. I'm just going to tell you what we're doing today. So, yep, there it is. It's been sitting i'm finally getting around to it i gotta fix this headlight because when they took it off the tow truck they broke the tabs off the headlight i, I don't even want to talk about that bro but it is what it is so um i'm about to take this wheel off and look at the suspension on it see exactly what's going on with the car i'm um, glad to be back recording for y'all i'm excited try to get this car back on the road pull this wheel off luckily the wheel isn't bent it just got hella damage like right here but that can be fixed all around i guess from it hitting when they, when they hit me on that side all right so it looks like i can't really tell this one looks good oh no that's bent so the lower looks bent right here. Lower looks bent. Let me look on this side. Yeah, so it needs a lower control arm. Luckily the shock, shock looks good. <gasps> lower I can't really see though because let's start lower. so I think it's just really just only this right here it needs to be fixed I don't see anything else that was that could have been damaged I mean the wheel turns and everything just fine this rotor, I need to put my <laughs> my rear rotors on. I got them at the crib. Because everything else I'm looking at, it doesn't look like it's damaged. Because on that side, I'm looking. Yeah. It's straight. That's the only thing I really see, man. So yeah, the fender, I mean, the quarter panel is really, it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I mean, it's bad, don't get me wrong, but... It could be worse. Um, and then I found out, looking at my steering wheel, somebody came over here and, and swapped out this part on my steering wheel. That's not the same. So I got to figure out who did that. They got cameras over here and everything, but like, come on, bro. Like, really? We, this this what we doing, bro? Like, we, we got to be better than this. Why are y'all taking stuff that's not yours? Like, why are you? This whole situation, this whole experience is like really been testing my patience, testing me as a person, my integrity, my, all of that. Like, all of that was pretty much almost out the window throughout all this because it's only so much somebody can take, you know, dealing with this. So I think I got a general idea of who did that to the steering wheel. We'll figure it out. I ain't worried about it. But yeah, so I'm about to try to go see if I can grab this part and try to come swap it out, see what it do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use the handbrake. That's actually doing it, bro. Nah, cause I'm gonna I'm drive it so I can go fix it. Fix the um, I said I'm gonna drive it so I can go fix the um, the brake line. That actually did it, bro. I'm pretty sure you could just pull this out right there. Do it like right here. Like, yeah, like, hold on, hold on, up, 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 like right there, yeah. Yeah, that's not bad though. 
a little bit more in here. It said on rub. Yeah, that's just that's, that's that's all I care about, bro. I honestly feel like this can be repaired, bro. It's really not even that bad. Let's get him with it. There was uh, he used the puller to kind of pull out the fender a little bit, um, just so my my wheel won't rub no more. Um, right here because it was rubbing like right there but i'm i'm definitely surprised that like any other part of my suspension was damaged it's only the trailing arm i know i just said that but i'm about to make a few calls see if i can get that fixed and he pulled that out good like the quarter panel is bad don't get me wrong it's bad but i feel like it's not that bad like i feel like i could probably maybe pull this out a little bit like right there but i'm afraid if i do that if it'll like break the metal and you don't want it to break and the rest of this can be hit bando maybe but i eventually just want to replace this whole quarter panel and get a new one like probably soon so um but yeah so and then on the front up here i don't know if i showed y'all the headlight but i fixed it somewhat it's like a temporary fix but it looks better than it was i just reversed this um this tab right here usually you buy a, uh, a headlight repair kit tab and that's what you do to um to fix these on these cars um i have put tape right here because there's water leaking through i really don't even need to put this right there I'll take that off. um i plan on replacing this bumper anyway <sighs> gonna be replacing the hood today as well um and then wrapping that and uh the same wrap right here i don't know if y'all can see it yeah so for the most part it's good the next thing is just replacing that trailing arm and then i'm gonna drive the car to my, my buddy's shop to replace that brake line so i can do that and then bleed the bleed the brakes and then the car be, be pretty much ready be back back in the and whatnot um but yeah good to be back recording um i just want to give a huge shout out shout out to everybody that's been supporting me rocking with me um this is only the beginning and we only going up from here so y'all remember that mark my words you feel me but yeah let's get that done enough of this talking hold on uh yeah it is that one hold on let me put this in the back of it all right wait biting on my side when I took it off the um that rear assembly I thought it was gonna be hard to do it because it was everything in a way like the death but it doesn't look that bad thing is got to part take this and pop it out is it, is it fully disconnected right here? Yeah. Uh, I take a hammer and fuck. just pop pop that pop that out. Yeah. Can you hit it from the other side of oh, the bolt? You coming out? Mm-hmm. Then take the wrench on the other side maybe, and then you could kind of tap the wrench. What do you mean? Out of the room. Put the the wrench like behind the head of it. Oh, to, to kind of pry it. Yeah, and just kind of shimmy it out. Where's the bolt at? Let's see if it can come out a little bit more. this right here yeah getting it done getting her done 
<laughs> Bro, is this is this shed metal? Yeah. Oh my god. Don't touch any metal. Right there, huh? I'm probably about to just time lapse this, so I'll let y'all know. I got it off right there. Just need to get this off, and uh, yeah. damage but other than that it's not that bad yeah it's still a little bit off it's, it, it, it actually looks good bro it doesn't even it don't look it don't look off it look like how it used to look yeah it's so this damage yeah it's still got to get yeah. taken care of right. but um other than that that's right. that with this, we're gonna drive it, go get the brake line repaired, fix it myself. But I think that's gonna conclude this video. I appreciate everybody having um, as much patience as y'all, as I had uh, without this, throughout this whole situation. I know it's been a process. I know y'all been wanting to see me upload and everything with the 335, but um, the time has come. It's time to get her back on the road. So y'all stay tuned. If you like the video, actually like the video, subscribe. Uh, comment down below, um, and I'm going to catch you on the next one. Let's go.